Um, but we, we found a World War II mortar bomb and I believe that it's still live. We brought it up on the shore. This is an emergency action notification. All broadcast stations and cable systems shall transmit this emergency action notification message. Yeah, we got it. Uh, it was up under the bridge. Yeah, yeah. In the water? Uh, yeah. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another video of Depths of History. Today, I brought my friend Jake along, and we're going to be diving at an abandoned World War II base. Now, guys, the story of this base, about 20 years ago, they tore down the World War II military base, and currently they have hotels sitting on it. So, by doing research with historical maps and overlaying old maps with the new maps, I was able to find out where this base currently stands, and we're gonna be diving underneath the bridge that's closest to it, looking for guns, and basically anything that has to do with this military base, but I'm really excited to bring Jake along. Jake, what do you think we're gonna find? Dude, this guy's been on a roll the past couple of times. He's found a bunch of guns. Seriously, there's no telling. I'm hoping to find maybe a gun, but you just never know. You know, you could dive 15 bridges and not find a single thing, but he knows his stuff, so I'm excited. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be great, man. Well, let's get in the water and let's see what it. we can find. It's gonna be good day. <laughs> Artillery shell from World War II, dude. Wow. From the base, it's live. It's, it's live. still live. Why'd you give it to me? <laughs> I don't know. I just picked it up. I put it in my pouch. Oh, you're so <laughs> it's not a, a real bomb. Yes. That's a real yes, deal. Yes, that's bomb. a real deal bomb. Holy Like, dude, crap. look. Look at this thing. Holy, Holy cow. So that's. <laughs> yeah. I don't even know if I should. think that could have... possibly still blow up? Yeah. It still has the fuse. So it still has the fuse. I didn't know there was a fuse. What do we do? Call bomb squad or something? We we need to we need to call the police or something because this is this thing is freaking crazy. Wow, dude, that's oh my god. Real. I, I want to just keep it on the yeah, shore. I don't want to keep it. Yeah. Near we me. Keep it on you as we search. All right, so Brent and I we're getting back underneath the water. Hopefully we can find some more crazy stuff. But I don't know if this gun stops out. It's freezing cold. Let's do it. All right. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god! Dude! Is it a 
So Britton and I just got out of the water and I can't believe it, but he brought this bomb. Uh, what we think, we did some research, is actually a World War II mortar. He put it right over here on the ground so the police can come and take a look at it. We got it away from the boat ramp, so away from anyone else's danger, but I'm still in the danger zone. Let me show you guys what it looks like real quick and we'll get the heck out of here. Check this thing out. Pretty gnarly, man. I've never seen anything like this before. And I was underwater holding it. I was like, you think this thing will blow up? Thinking like, you know, it wouldn't. He's like, yeah. And I was like, okay, take it back. <laughs> like, I don't want anything to do with it. But it's pretty wild, man. I've never seen anything like it before. This video is going to be crazy. I know. It's, it's going to be really crazy. All right. So we're going to call the police. Make sure you guys keep following along this adventure. Britton, dude, this is a crazy find. Probably the coolest find ever. <laughs> For sure. So Jake, what did you end up finding today, buddy? I found a few cool things. Nothing crazy like you. But I found a Georgia license plate. Nice. That's kind of cool. I found a potential murder weapon. <laughs> and uh, I'd say my favorite find of the day is this watch. Check that thing out. That's super cool, man. I actually found this fanning, and it's really old, and the inside actually might be rose gold, if I'm correct. But I'm not too sure. That's awesome, I'm man. I'm going to let my imagination run wild with that one. But I also got another really cool thing. Oh, really? Yeah, a golf ball. Hey, nice! <laughs> but these are all my favorite finds of the day, that's for sure. That's awesome, man. Thanks, man. All right, guys, so I ended up finding some cool stuff other than that mortar bomb. Obviously, we like to pick up trash out of the river, so I got a bunch of cans, a bunch of various different types of cans. They've all got sand in them and stuff, but I found some other pretty cool, interesting things. Found this piece. I'm not really sure what this is. If you have any ideas, let me know in the comments below. Oh, I know what that is. It's a part to a tank. Is it really? Yeah. Man, dude, That's we're incredible. finding all crazy, yeah, all sorts of crazy stuff today. <laughs> Man. Um, I did find some sunglasses in there. Hey, uh, they're, cool. I guess they broke in my bag. Uh, find for me that was crazy. Oh yeah, lady. this pistol, man, that that is insane. We found that in and amongst the rocks uh, below the bridge, and that is one of the craziest finds I think yeah. um, I've ever come across. So that is that is really cool. Scuba diving, seeing what we can find. Scuba oh, diving. Oh, yeah. okay. What did you find here? You want to see? Come over here. I'll show you. Yeah. So Britain, Britain's really good at diving. Oh, really okay. <laughs> Wow. Bottom of the bridge today. Yeah. Really? Wow. Yeah. So we don't know how, what, what it, why it was used and how it landed hey, here. Don't, hey, yeah, hey, don't act it. all innocent. I know you threw that in there. <laughs> yeah. Nice. That was, uh, it's pretty crazy. I don't know if it has any serial numbers on it or not. It's okay. basically like half of the gun, but uh -huh. uh, that was definitely a crazy find. Oh, that it was. Uh, it was in and amongst the rocks. It was actually fanning and I saw the middle portion of it. It was okay. pretty crazy. Yeah. So you just wow. went under the river and then you found that? Yeah, we went under underneath the bridge over here. Oh, really? oh under the bridge? Oh, okay. there it is. Wow. <laughs> yeah, they probably chucked it off the bridge. You know, you never know. <laughs> Did you find anything else besides like a skeleton? Oh, we found something crazy, but I can't tell you now. You gotta watch this video. Okay. <laughs> We're actually okay. waiting for the police to come right now. Are you so, okay? Yeah. It's, oh, they're coming. It's pretty serious. You hear him? Oh, yeah. Wow. You hear him? Yeah, I think they're coming. Are they really? Yeah. Oh my god. So I work with Jake on a daily basis, and we don't really find things quite like this. Uh, I'm always waiting and eager for something to come out of the water that super exciting and uh, you know something that just levels up everything that we found in the past. And I think that this definitely has done it. Um, I come from the military, so I feel like I sort of have like a, a kind of a cautious. Uh, outlook towards these sort of things and this is definitely a little sketchy uh so they're gonna call the cops you're gonna call the cops yeah. and see what they have to say um i definitely think that they're probably gonna want to blow it up or uh, have someone come out here and kind of defuse it make sure it's deemed safe so let's see what they say thank you yeah. <sighs> what do you think man Dude. i don't i don't even know what to do right now i know right isn't like, your heart like beating right now 
Like, my heart was in my throat. We found, what, what do you call it, a mortar? mortar. We found a freaking bomb, dude. Yeah. <laughs> like, from World War II, it could be live still, right? It, there's a chance. Yeah, there's a chance. I mean, it, it doesn't have any holes in the top of it, like where the fuse yeah. would be. That's, that's what's scaring me a little bit. But. So, yeah, we were definitely on edge when we found it. What we're going to do right now is call the police. They might have someone, uh, like, bomb squad or something come down. I've never, like, had a situation like this, you know? We called the police about weapons. And he found a pistol, which is pretty wild. But that's we've never crazy. found, like, a bomb. So, I don't really know what it looks like after this, but this is pretty awesome, and I'm hoping you guys are enjoying this. This is a crazy experience. We got it out of the river because, like, there's rafters and tubers going down. You just never know if that could go off, you know? So, I think this is the safest way to go about it. We got it off away from everyone's harm's way, but, dude, what a crazy find. That's what I'm saying, dude. It's, I'm, I'm just in shock right now with, with everything that's happened within the past, like, hour and a half, <laughs> dude. It's been... It's been a chain of events. So. Dude, it has been. I'm yeah. proud of you, though. Okay, man. All right, take this thing off. Um, but we, we found a World War II mortar bomb, and I believe that it's still live. We brought it up on the shore. It's not anywhere near the boat ramp or where anybody could get hurt, but um, we did bring it up on the shore, and I do want to get someone out here just to check it out and make sure you know, that, that we can take care of this. I'm not sure what the protocol is. Okay, not a problem. Give me one moment, and I'll um, get someone on the way to you. We found it underneath the bridge while we were scuba diving. It looks pretty rusted up, but I'm not really sure what to do, so we just wanted to make sure we could call you guys. Okay, that was, that's good. We appreciate that. Give me one second. What's your name? Uh, Britton Lockhart. What's a good callback number for you? It's... All right, guys, so we just got off the phone with the police. They're going to be coming over here to the boat dock with us to see this World War II mortar bomb. Um, I don't really know what the protocol is going to be for this, so when they show up, we're going to turn on the cameras and let you know what happens. All right, y'all right. come on up. Yeah. Just wanted to set it up for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, 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 yep. we found it. Uh, it was up under the bridge? Yes, sir. Yeah. In the water? Or? Uh, yes, sir. In the water, yes, sir. Check the six Pretty crazy, huh? Yes, it is. All right, so we got people here. They told us we got to get off the boat ramp now. I don't know why that was under that. Yeah, that's a, that's a, that's a under the bridge? Yeah. Um, are y'all gonna stick around? Cause yeah, we're yeah, probably gonna talk. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like to see the, the whole kill, The kill radius on that yeah. thing is about 30 feet. So. Are you 30 feet. Yeah. Oh my god. I was holding it. <laughs> That's <laughs> awful, man. <laughs> he said the kill radius is about 30 feet, and I was holding that thing. Hopefully, it's a dummy round, but shit, there's no, yeah, no reason to take us. Yeah, exactly. All right, there's all types of police officers here right now. They're trying to kick everyone out of this area just to be safe, you know, take out all those extra precautions. But they're gonna keep us here so they can ask their questions. But this is pretty unreal, man. Got two here. I see a couple over there, a couple over there, and a couple on the bridge, and they're just blocking everything off. The response rate, let, let me just Yeah, that you, like, was fast. <laughs> the, the response rate was super quick. It, yeah. was, like, it was like that. You and, know, um, when we find a gun, it sometimes it can take a couple hours for a police officer to come, but a bomb, five minutes. <laughs> that was pretty crazy. So, <laughs> police came and interviewed us and now they're kicking us off the park. So we're going to get off the park here and just show you guys this chaotic mess out here. Um, it should be pretty gnarly. guys thank you guys so much for watching if you guys are new to the channel please be sure to leave a like and subscribe today was an absolutely crazy yeah. day Jake and honestly I'm so surprised that we were able to find that underneath the pillar of the bridge man if we would have had any sudden movements or that thing would go off underneath the bridge it could have caused the pillar to collapse cars would have gone in the water it just would have been a bad day so yeah. I'm really glad that we were able to get out out of the water it was kind of stupid for me to pick it up honestly yeah. <laughs> but in that murky water it's really hard to tell what's what under well, you know there, what so. everything like kind of pans out for a good reason you know we got that away Away from the bridge potentially saving lives of that now it's in the hands of bomb squad they're gonna do everything they need to do and it's just out of the river so you did a good thing thank you yeah, man it was a great day and uh, if you guys want to check out more videos I got links in the description as well but with that said thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you guys on the next adventure bye guys <laughs>